I went down to Southern Oregon last summer to do a tour of some of the libraries down there. When I was down there, it was when the gas prices were really high. So the librarian, the head librarian, told me that he would drive me out to the remote locations. Uh, some of them were like 30, 45 minutes away. I thought that was really nice. And, and uh, that afternoon, as we were heading out to one of the branch libraries, we got attacked by this huge swarm of bugs came, you know, flying across our windshield. It was like, bah, 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 I asked him what happened, and he said that these were these midges, that uh, it, it happens every summer. And these big swarms of midges will come flying off of the lake and, uh, you know, and our car nails them, and then we have to go to the car wash, you know, a couple times a week. Well, the next morning, I uh, went to the coffee shop, and I had, I had one more um, show there in, at the Klamath County Library. So I was just hanging out, reading the paper before I went to the show, and the newspaper had this article about midges. It had a big picture of this close-up of these, like, almost neon green insects. They looked like mosquitoes, but they didn't have the nose, you know, to poke you. So, anyway, the article went on to say that these, these uh, midges, or, or coronamidae, as they're scientifically known, um, go around, and, and they can't uh, sting you. They're just more just an annoyance than anything else. Well, at the end of the article, there was a little competition that the paper was sponsoring. You could do something creative, write something creative about midges, a little story or a poem or whatever. And I thought, this is great. This is a, this is a fun you know, exercise. I'll uh, write a little song about midges, and I'll take it to the show and uh, share it with the audience, and uh, we'll see how it goes. <clears throat> so I wrote this song. And believe it or not, I did not win the contest. green, we're small, we fly in big clouds. We're mixed by gosh of that, we are proud. A nuisance is what some people say, but our proper name is Coronamidae. When people drive through us, they are splats and splashes. The only ones who like us all own car washes. Some folks say, it sounds like it's raining, but we're the ones who are dying, why are they complaining? We're green, we're small, we fly in big clouds, and which by gosh of that we are proud. A nuisance is what some people say, but a proper name is Coronamidae. We spend all summer as larvae in the lake. Trying to avoid those fishes and snakes Once we grow into flies, we look for a mate Lucky for us, it's easy to find a date <laughs> We're green, we're small, we fly in big clouds We're midges by gosh of that, we are proud A nuisance is what some people say But our proper name is Coronamidae that you know us, we hope you understand. And do us a favor, lend us a hand. Don't drive through and kill us, leave us alone. Besides, with gas prices like they are, isn't it better to stay home? <laughs> we're green, we're small, we fly in big clouds. We're midges by gosh of that, we are proud. A nuisance is what some people say, but our proper name is Coronamidae. Our proper name is Coronamidae. Please don't forget the Coronamidae. Can't believe I didn't win with that.